Like and subscribe and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Pro Golfer staunchly supports the Saudi League over the PGA Tour. Why on earth would you not go? Saudi Golf League is in the limelight once again for the recent involvement of PGA Tour professionals. Various golfers have asked for a release to play on the rival tour. Amidst all the speculations, Matt Southgate recently spoke about what makes the Saudi-backed league catchy for young golfers. Matt Southgate recently appeared on an episode of Sky Sports Golf Podcast. The DP World Tour professionals spoke about the Live Golf International Series. The English professional talked about how a current lot of golfers may not play on the rival tour, but it is the young generation of players who could join it. Advertisement at the same time, he also discussed how the free-to-enter Q score with colossal prize money purses could make the Saudi-backed golf league more interesting. However, he spoke these words while expressing the loyalty of the current professionals in staying on the PGA Tour and showing disinterest towards the SGL. He said, the most overlooked thing with the Saudi Tour at the minute is that everybody is focusing on the players of today and nobody is thinking of the players of tomorrow. If they then produce the best players in the world, you instantly become second and third in the world. That's five to ten years of patiently waiting to produce your own players, and that's scary he added, everyone goes to PGA Euro Pro Tour School to go and play for ten grand a week, so why on earth would you not go to the Saudi Tour School and earn much more? All they're doing is taking a punt that you're going to be the best players in 2026, 2027 or 2030. Rome wasn't built in a day. Matt's words seem to explain his support for the Live Golf International Series over the PGA Tour. According to reports, 15 of the top 100 professionals in the world will play the opening event in June. The first event will be played at the Centurion Club. Norman also told Sports Illustrated that he plans to invite amateurs to participate in the eight-event schedule. If the report holds true, Southgate's point highlighted in the podcast may become a reality. Advertisement Who are the professionals supposedly competing in the SGL? Phil Mickelson is among the group of professionals who have asked the PGA Tour for a release to play in the first event of the rival tour. A report by The Telegraph also suggests that the lefty has signed an agreement to play all the events. Moreover, he has also received a sum of $30 million up front. Apart from him, Sergio Garcia has also asked the PGA Tour to allow him to play the first event. And the world number 15 Louis Oosthuizen has also asked for the same. Lee Westwood, Ian Poulter, and Kevin Na are the other prominent names to ask for a release. However, only time will tell whether all of the speculated professionals will play on the SGL or not. Advertisement What do you think about Southgate's words? Watch this story, John Daly reveals his lost dream to play in the NFL for the Colts.